started. He like, I, I saw her even enter the room and be like, hey, I'm here, I'm modding. It's not fair, I'm drunk. <laughs> You're not drunk enough, man. I wish I was. I wish I was drunk. Yeah, you do. <laughs> yeah, still Why lost, Dan. <laughs> oh, she left. See, I wasn't here at first. Oh, okay, fair enough. So, by all means, please blow me, metaphorically. And even then, I'd rather not. Anyway, you were saying something weird. So when I moved into the apartment I live in now, the fridge came with a free bottle of vodka. That's um, interesting. <laughs> that doesn't sound like a bad idea right now. <laughs> um, it was closer to rubbing alcohol than actual vodka. Yeah, Ooh, what it was terrible. Uh, why did you do what, John? Sorry, yeah. force of habit. I thought after the first checkpoint was when I could start doing that, not the second. Do you remember the brand of vodka? This is important. Um... It was in a plastic bottle. It had a red label that was not any of the bottom shelf vodkas. I'm familiar with. I thought it was like. Well, I don't know. That's like red label, really interesting. Yeah, like a red and silver label. Definitely um, not Smirnoff. No, no, definitely not Smirnoff. Smirnoff definitely not wasn't coming to And that's well, we not. Just... It's not Burnett's because Burnett's doesn't have a red label. Yeah. It was like. I thought it was King something. Um, no, it's not Everclear. No. It was terrible. No, you'd recognize the, if it was Everclear. The label um, reminded me of like a Tesco label for <laughs> anyone who's not from the States. <laughs> it seriously reminded me of a Tesco label. It was not Smirnoff. It might have actually been Tesco. I don't know. <laughs> Which is how I should have kept it in that case. Um, what? The, the exchange fun. between Dan and Amber in the chat was just really funny to me. Fuck, are you serious? John. I don't remember. Oh, it's the jump button is what you press. Okay. The Besky? That might have been it. Dan says in quotes, behind? please blow me. P call 2013. And Amber replies, P call says that every year, not just. You. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so it. true. Oh, blow me, anyway. Dan. Back to this terrible bottle of vodka. Oh, oh. God. No, why are we going back to the I wound up drinking it for him because I decided, Anger. fuck it, I wanted a night of drinking. Um, so I drank, I think, what, half the bottle by myself? I'm surprised you drank any of the bottle by yourself. Is this a uh, fifth? Um, no, it was like a liter of vodka. A good hand. <laughs> you got a free handle of vodka? Yeah, it's like a, it's like no, a solid fifteen dollars if you didn't know what brand it was. No, it was well, it was. I think it was cheaper than that. It, it, it no. seriously tastes like rubbing alcohol. I think no. it was rubbing alcohol just in a bottle of vodka. Oh man, um, they just got really because, desperate, I guess. Maybe. It, it was the way it burned going down. I'm ninety percent sure it was just rubbing alcohol. Whoa, um, whoa, what the like, fuck? What the fuck? Damn. I Stomping to bed that night without realizing it. Oh, what you just? Oh, I. Oh, you missed. Part I didn't know you could do that. I thought I. I thought I clipped through it for a second there. Nah, you just sucked. Fuck it, I landed too late. Shit, I can't believe I you lost this again. To, you need to twist when you roll, sir. Really? Just keep double tapping the uh, X button. I would no. not want to drink mouthwash. Like I'm like, never that desperate for no. alcohol. I'm talking about like the vertical jump, like the one vertical jump that happens. Yeah. Go up through the layers, do a twist while you roll, like hold the twist button. Fuck, ah, I can't believe that happened again. Amber, it's okay, I get called thunder tips when I'm typing. Thunder tips? Yes. Thunder tits. <laughs> oh! Yeah, that's what I thought she said in the first time. I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> How does that Hundred even? Tits. All right. Hundred tits. Ho. Yo. Oh god, that came out. <laughs> How is he faster than me coming off these spins? Did you? You didn't. I you lost did. because I got clipped through the bottom. No, John, not you. Oh. Um. My words per minute is up to like eighty or nineties, which isn't great, but. Are you are you okay? What's what's Brad. wrong? Brad. What? I I just think I heard you say 
that, uh, quote unquote, that just came out? No, they. They. <laughs> plural. They just came out. They. So it did ha- okay, it did happen. You, you said Thunder Tits Ho and Thunder Tits Ho. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure that I heard that correctly, and now my, my fears have been confirmed. Why All are right. they fears? My boobs are nothing to be feared. Yep. All <laughs> boobs. You crush a small country with them. All boobs shall be feared and respected through fear. Yes. Oh. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> no! God fucking piece of shit. Ah. Oh. Tough break. What if, what if God fucked a piece of shit? That'd be really gross. Why would God do that? Well, He's got you, a bunch of free time You're on the one that brought it up, John. You're the one saying the hard thing. <laughs> Timinator says my boobs are nothing to be feared. But I'm I'm curious how you said that my boobs could crush a small country. It was a joke. It's it's thunder boobs. They're special. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they make l <laughs> they make thunder noises. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to get that checked out. <laughs> Um, you miss the hand motions and self growth oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure they're fine. <laughs> With the way you were you were enacting that, your your tits made more noise than a sun chips bag. <laughs> well then, <laughs> should we give you two some alone time? <laughs> we have that already. We're fine. Oh my goodness. <laughs> So, John, thanks for adding me to your stream. <laughs> <laughs> no problem, Brad! Thanks, John. That was, that was just the best PSA. <laughs> <laughs> Snorting. That's, like, that's like what my, my roommate and his girlfriend do. I'm like, we're just hanging out downstairs, and they're like, all right, we're going to go upstairs now. I'm like, oh, you're going to go have sex? And they're like, no. She gave me a blowy about half an hour ago. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> thanks. I was kidding. Okay. God. Surprise! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Are you actually gonna win this one? Yeah, I didn't fuck it up for once. Yeah, nice. there you go. Finally. It only took him like him five tries himself. or something. No, he's got it. No, I got like a four minute, le four second lead. Not in the AI rubber band in this one, anyways. No, it does rubber band on this. Yeah. Super hardcore. <laughs> Hooray, my unicycle got a medal. I need to, <laughs> I need to pee and get beer. Okay. 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 So make sure you do that in the right order. <laughs> I will pee beer. <laughs> Alright. Um, do I keep uniracing? I uni promise I'm not trying to be disturbing. Do I keep uniracing or do I move on to something else? I don't know, the universe is kind of entertaining to watch. Alright, which which area has Wario paint? I want to say that's Hopper. Yes, Wario paint. <laughs> if anybody is curious if I'm drunk, no, I'm completely sober at this point. No, you know, I'm drunk when here's Patrick. Yeah, drunk. <laughs> that's what you think. <laughs> Says the perpetually sober one. That's what I say. Tonight at the barcade, they had a drink called the Alyssa Milano, and Alyssa Milano is why my first name is Alyssa. So I had to have it. Um, hey, guess who starred in the Double Dragon movie? Alyssa Milano? Yep. <laughs> oh man, topical! <laughs> did you did you see her her sex tape? No. It, it's on Funny or Die. It's on Funny or Die. It's, it's pretty funny. They oh, make it, oh, yeah, I have seen that. Yeah, so the one that builds up that makes you think like it's going to be a proper sex tape, and then it just, the camera pans over to like a news reporting on Syria. That was genius. Well, you got to say she knew how to get attention. Yeah. And lost. And, oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm trying to pull up what was all in this drink. Uh, just one second. Alcohol and juice. More than that... Well, that's most drinks in a nutshell. It had it well, was actually, garnished. Actually, a drink in a nutshell would be kind of tiny. It was a, it was garnished with a lemon. Get it right. Mm, what? Eat a lemon. Okay, I appear to be. Oh. Right. So Patr
I'm drinking Guinness Stout tonight. Oh, okay. Is that the one that comes like the metal bottle with a little thingamajigger in it? No, that's draft. Okay. That's like so, ten times thicker than stout. Yeah, I know it's super thick, I just didn't know. So uh, this cocktail that I had tonight. Dark. Stout's just dark. Draft is like you're drinking Guinness sludge. Delicious Guinness sludge, but that's basically like a meal in a can. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. I just the mental image. Yes, I know. Anyway, what was all in the Alyssa Milano at this barcade is um, Bombay Sapphire Gin, Cranberry, Lemon, Lime, and Sprite. So, sir... Three of those things are the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> they heard of that she's reading it off the website, but still. Yes, I am reading it off the website. Um, so they've got exotic rum, regular rum, Scottish rum, Irish rum... And um, Sprite. <laughs> so they also have a drink called the uh, Burt Reynolds. Let me see if I can find out. It's bourbon, sugar, orange, cherry, and something I can't pronounce. Anagostro Anagos bitters. Yeah. It puts hair on your chest if you're into them. I don't think so, but you know. I was going to try to get him to try it, but he had to drive my ass home, so. Yeah, so. You were the DD. What puts hair on your chest? Usually the DD. Drinking no, a sir. No chaser. For the past four months of the DD. You have a head your... What? If you're looking to put hair on your chest with alcohol, then you need to take a straight shot of bourbon with no chaser. Really just drink any hard whiskey, from what I hear. No, no. Bourbon. Really? Bourbon? Oh, mm. bourbon. On the rocks or not? No, just straight a shot. Ooh. That's that's brutal. What yeah. was it? Straight bourbon. I, uh, I, can, I can nurse bourbon on the rocks, but just a shot of straight bourbon, that's... It's harsh. <laughs> yeah. If, it, if it's first thing in the morning, that'll wake your ass up. It Yes, exactly. I think the worst shot I ever did Miles, was that Miles has done. Miles has done it. Miles has tear, hair on his chest. Or that rum chest. wasn't bad. Assuming his. I mean, it tastes terrible. That's why I'm no, saying worse. No, that rum wasn't terrible tasting. It just, it was, it was, um, an acquired taste. Like coffee. For, for me personally, tequila, in terms of harshness, tequila is right behind bourbon. Oh yeah, tequila's pretty harsh. See, that, I will do shots that. of tequila all the time. I, I'm just not big into, like, the whole... Gin or rum? Johnson and I were like, I'm playing video games and I like water. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I drink so much alcohol. Guys, John okay, is drunker John. than drunk. Yep, I am entirely made of alcohol right now. The most. Did anyone read that story of that guy, I think it's down in Texas, that um, had so much homemade alcohol, homemade beer, that he got enough like, the, of the yeast in his stomach that now his body just produces alcohol by itself? I read that article today. No. Actually. He yeah. he brewed so much beer that he ended up like somehow getting the yeast in his stomach. Yeah, you get that from like drinking the the un the, if, you, if you like drink the part you're supposed to scrape out of the beer. Um, yeah, it's like he didn't for, he didn't ferment it enough or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it it can it, yeast can live in your stomach to a degree. That just sounds unpleasant. This sounds yeah. ridiculous. Like he, like he got a mutant superpower or something. Well, the thing is, it's like he, he just got drunk out of nowhere all the time, apparently. And the thing a lot of the comments aren't realizing is like that's legitimately dangerous. You could be sitting there and get alcohol poisoning within like three hours, and you can get severe alcohol poisoning, and then you can die within like six hours if your body produces the amount of alcohol they're saying it does. I'm like, that's not a superpower. That's a death. I don't think that he had that much yeast in his stomach to do that. I don't think he did either, but there, one of the articles was saying he had to go to the ho hospital after church because he got alcohol poisoning sitting in church. A after church? No. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. He got drunk after church, and his wife okay. was with him, so she, she knew that he wasn't drinking. So she's like, why are you drunk right now? We need to see what's wrong with you. Okay. That's what I, I read. Can't, I can't attest how well the articles are written, because I read, I read like two of them. They're like both kind of skimming facts. Yeah, the, the one I read was, like, the authorities and his wife both believed he was drinking on the sly. Because, mm -hmm. like, who the fuck gets drunk without drinking? <laughs> yeah. Well, so, I like I had it. <laughs> that's why she was finally like, all right, we're taking you to the hospital after he got drunk after being in church without drinking. Yeah. A terrible so. place to get drunk. 
Uh, and man, that communion one. wine. Some people. Oh yeah, that stuff just gets me going. You'd be surprised. There are people who legitimately try to just to do communion just for the wine. Really? Hey, when I when I go to college bars, I'm just like, yeah, I'll take a pint of the blood of Christ. <laughs> and they're like, on the rocks. I'm like you betcha. And then I just get sleep <laughs> bodily fluid. I thought you were gonna say on the rocks, just like Jesus. <laughs> oh man, do a growl over Jesus. Yay, my unicycle got another medal. The image I linked is sorta of safe for work. Okay, hold on. Where, where is this going? Where is the link? Ah! <laughs> yes! Oh wait, it might be here. Hold on. Oh. I can I can work this. I can work this. I swear I can work this phone. Are you oh, sure? No. I like no. no. I don't know what's going on. I am confusing myself. Dan, the more I'm around your antics, the more I enjoy your company. <laughs> I have in fact lost. <laughs> I got told John too soon about the blood of Christ. Oh, is it? Damn? It's barely been two millennia. Hey, oh, yeah. good lord. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's a thing. But, um. Yeah. Alright. I think, I think Unirasers might end up being the last game. I That's think fine. I think we're gonna do some QA and then we'll call it for the night. Probably not a bad idea. It's two o two out here. Yeah. yeah. So let's go to good old intermission. Good night, Obi Wan. Well, good you know what? What? It's okay, this is not the stream you're looking for, anyways. <laughs> I'll play random games on my stream. You can raid me. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna you're literally gonna stream just so we can raid? Yeah. Why the fuck not? Nah, that works for me. I just won't announce it anywhere or anything. All right. Well, let's just let's get some questions going. Any questions you have for anyone in the call? Let's get them going. I'm gonna start uh, flipping through my my gift folder while we're at it. Whew. Oh wait, I have a gift for John to throw up to make all the manly people feel extra manly. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. I'm sorry, Brian. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, why can't oh. I operate things? Hold on. Oh god, the questions. I'm Hold looking on. to an extra manly gif in the chat. It's extra manly. If I could click on it. Oh yeah, that's manly as fuck, man. <laughs> manly as fuck. What is it? If you're uh, in if you're in the call and you're a girl, are you a call girl? Yes. Oh. Twitch, go fuck yourself. What's up? Oh, their their official Twitter, their official Twitch Twitter. Return of the King, Cosmo Right is now live. Uh, so the Twitch wind. can go suck a dick, suck a bag oh, of dicks. My God. Hey man, he streams a lot, so. Yeah. He probably he probably brings them a ton of money. Not gonna lie. Well, yeah, but fucking Return of the King. Cause like he was John, gone. John, what is your like, favorite intermission screen gif? I don't even think he has the world record in Wind Waker anymore. I don't know. Let me see what I have oh, in really? my folder. See what. Yeah, I'm gonna look. If see what I have in my folder. Have to take it back. Oh wait, I also have another super manly gif. Oh goodness. Yeah, Mon Miles goodness. has been really hitting him out of the park with his chat messages tonight. Cosmo's a cool guy, but the dick sucking needs to stop. That's a <laughs> how I feel. Like, I enjoy his streams, but holy shit. He is... What he is, is your guys' opinion on Southern Comfort? I don't like it. Oh, man, I, I could, I'll, I'll down a bottle of Southern Comfort. I like the commercial a lot. This one? Oh, that's just adorable. The one with the oh, pop. Oh, Red Panda. Each. This is the one I was looking for. Ow. Oh. John, being from Montreal, do you think there's a chance I would ever get to meet you? Uh, I don't know. I've only been to Montreal once in my life. Twice, secondly, because I drove through there. Uh, you have a higher odds of seeing me over here in Alberta. Or at a con in the States. Oh, apparently Chaos Runner says he got the world record back recently. Oh, yeah. See, like, he's not the best. He recently is, but he's not, like... I don't know. It's weird. I like the panda one. He is basically the PewDiePie. <laughs> he is the PewDiePie of Twitch, where it's a really cool guy, 
a lot of people don't like his streams. A lot of people do like his streams, and he has a really fucking ridiculous fan base for the most part. Mm. That's a good. That's an accurate assessment. For Pickle and John, were you nervous when you first started? Let's play. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You're basically talking to yourself and hoping people will watch. Yup. In the case of John, you were shouting at yourself. Yeah, well, uh, always, I always shout at myself, so. That's both yeah, of us. True. Yeah, I guess it's true. When you're, I feel like you shout less in your in your videos now, Patrick. Yes, I made a change. I felt hey, I needed to, so I did. Good change. I think so. Jeff to the world ask, where are you moving to? I'm still staying in Calgary, but I'm moving to a new location. To hell! Are you still staying up on a hill? Yes. Good man. And then, uh, I'm, I'm not in a place that needs to worry about flooding. You read one of them. <laughs> I have to read one of them? Yes. Ah, blah, 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 blah. Do you ever regret LPing, John? Sometimes. I feel like my life would... I'd play a lot more video games if I didn't. Yeah. Whenever I look at the TRG comment section. Man, mm. that comment section's terrifying. Oh, man. I. You know what? Patrick, I'll ask you this. Do you think I should actually put that stream highlight of the, the fanfic? Or not the fanfic, the game? No. You don't think so? No. No. You'll think it's funny for a little bit, but people will never let go of it. Yeah, that's a good point. That, that's the, one of the reasons. You'll get people shouting it to you at conventions. Yeah. That and thousands and thousands more people will know about it. Wait, you would play more games if you didn't LP? Yeah, no, I would basically I play more up-to-date games because I feel like I'm always like trying to think of either streams for stuff to do or for actual Let's Play stuff. What games from my past do I love that I could let's play? Never. What game could I go out and buy and just play for myself and have in my library? Are you saying that to me, or are you just agreeing with me? I'm agreeing with you. Okay, cool. Well, like, yeah, that's, 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 that's like a legitimate concern. Right? It's like, most people are like, oh, this game's coming out, I'm super excited for it. And for us, it's like... I need to find a game that I can play and talk over where it'll be entertaining for people. Blah, blah, blah. Instead of, I want that game. <laughs> <laughs> um, since I keep seeing this question pop up, it says, thoughts on the Ivy slash Orchid death battle? Uh, I did not watch it. But I'm assuming that's Ivy from Soul Calibur versus Orchid from Killer Instinct. I that'd be, no that'd be my guess, yeah. John, can I just say I'm shocked that you don't have the Batman thumbs up gif on your intermission? I can probably fix that in a second. Yeah, if you, you do. John, wasn't Superman 64 supposed to return after Resident Evil? Not rushing, just haven't heard anything. Okay, um, on every video I've uploaded recently, I've had a link to a Facebook page. And it's literally a post explaining what's going on with Superman 64. Basically, last time I did a recording, it fucked up. It kept, like, speeding up and slowing down, so my drivers are fucked up. So I tried getting around that. I ordered a part in, and I tried to use that to mitigate the problem, but it did not work. And this was as of, like, last week. So right now, it's like, okay, I'll have to mess around and try to fix it. But at the same time, I kind of have to find a place to live, which that only got resolved yesterday. So now it's, okay, I have the pack to move to the new place. So basically... It's not going to be Superman until sometime in October. Uh, I do have some more Double Dragon 2 to post, but I'm out of I'm out of stream highlights, basically, unless I upload that FTL <laughs> run. <laughs> I'm out of stream highlights. I actually have to make content now. No, yeah, for all, all two I uploaded. <laughs> Dude, you know, I feel you. Well, here's the thing, and, and maybe this is my, my mental way of looking at it, but the reason I don't just knock out like a ton of NES LPs and just upload those to like mitigate the time is because I know that people don't want that. Because they want to just see Superman, and I want to be able to post Superman, but I can't get a version of Superman that I like. Or I think in the end people are going to be okay with that because, I mean, hell, what was the, you're still not reached the longest time between episodes yet. I'm getting close to it, though. You're close, but you haven't reached it, and I think, you know... You know, but the worst part was, like, I like, okay, cool, I had everything planned, I had my run, like, written down for a long time, like, all, these are the specific glitches I'm gonna hit during my one specific run. And then, and I even prepared, like, the in-flight movie for the next episode, like, that's how prepared I was for this episode. 
And then just when the tech stuff started going to shit, I was like, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Finally, a point where I start trying to get ahead, and it just pushes me even farther back. I was... I'm so pissed at Superman, I don't want to touch it, basically. So what you should do is LP uh, NES Superman game. I... Uh, no. That game, that game I, is I'm stupid. joking. Yeah, I was gonna say, that game's shit. How often do you guys get recognized by strangers for being popular on YouTube? Uh, if it's a con gaming convention... Quite a bit. Yeah, but if it's, like, real life, very rarely. I've never... Well, okay. Once in real life and never just randomly recognized like hey I go to your school we should do a video and I was like okay it's Tanmer I don't know if you guys know who Tanmer is I've heard the name yeah yeah name rings a bell he sent me a message he's like hey I go to U of O too I also do Let's Plays that's pretty cool it was never like walking down campus and Pickle I would ah, I don't want that to happen ever no, that sounds terrifying. I don't think I've ever met anyone who would like would just do that. Uh, I got recognized in a mall of all places uh, while I was in the food court, and these two guys just came up to me and they're like, "Hey, uh, is your name John?" I'm like, yeah, because I laughed and because I knew where it was going. But uh, no, they were super chill. Like, I there there are some people who would do something like that, just scream out like your username in real life in a hallway, which would just be like, "What the fuck are you doing?" <laughs> I'm lucky in that regard because my username on a lot of things is Griffy, and my last name is Griffin, so it's not that far of a jump. Mm. Um, so oh. I do get called Griffy pretty often anyway. See, at least for but me, it's like people will just scream John. I'm like, oh, okay, that sounds sensible. Mine's yeah. an anagram of my abbreviation more so than anagram of my full name. So I do enjoy, though, John, the look you, you had when... Uh, at PAX East, I decided to, as opposed to shouting your name, just shout out Bruce Willis, because you had this panic, like, oh god, I need to flee look. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I wasn't sure what to expect, and I was like, oh, okay, Bruce Willis. <laughs> yeah, no, I just wanted to see what look you would have, to be honest. More Mario Ron hacks! Fuck, dude, no! dude. No! I've, I've had a bunch of people posting lately saying that they're only subscribed to me because of Superman and ROM hacks. Really? Well, that's yeah. like all you did for what? Two years or so? Something like that. And then I'm like, okay, I, I'm done because they're just not fun anymore. I took that huge, like, nine-month break without doing any videos. Uh, then I came back, finished off TKO. Then you met me at PAX Prime 2011, and things just came back together. <sighs> it's all because of Everything is because of me. The universe mm, is because of me. No. <laughs> Isn't your Ninja Gaiden LP technically older than the Super Mario stuff, though? Oh, yeah, no. I, I did a. Yeah. I didn't start Mario ROM hack stuff till I'd done like five or six NES LPs. Yeah, because oh. I remember subscribing to you, and that's. Well, I can't remember. I don't think it was subscribing. It was following you technically on Google. John, video read the message things. from the Arcade Paladin. Sorry to interrupt. You need to read that message. It'll cheer you up. <laughs> I'm only subscribed to you because you're a genuinely awesome guy. I appreciate that. There you Aww. go. Thank you. I appreciate that. Let me just read out some of the choice comments I got. Uh, let me see if I can find it here now. They're all they're funny enough. They're all on my Kaizo videos. Chenzo Beta, you betcha. Gonna find that comment. The only thing that keeps me subscribed is good old Let's Play Superman 64. After that, all that's left is the old ROM hacks and the Let's Play of Super Superman 64. I'll make a good ROM hack. How about one more chance, John? Please. And I'm trying to think of what the... There was an original comment that led to me saying something that someone responded to that had that in it. Give me a second, I'll get that. Uh, someone had posted, I wish you would do more ROM hacks again. I can't stay subscribed to his more recent crap. So I responded like, I'm sorry, but I'm done with my ROM hacks. I don't enjoy them anymore. And my, any attempts to try to record them either lead into me not having any fun or having too much drama associated with them to be enjoyable. If you're not a fan of recent stuff for game selection, then I'm sorry, but thank you for at least checking it out. And uh, there's another one that I gotta find. I can't find now. Yeah, I used to when uh, um, people would mention that they, they you don't do ROM hacks anymore. I used to like know a couple YouTubers off the top of my head that did like Super Mario ROM hacks all the time. But a lot of them started like signing on to other networks, and now they don't do them. One of the big ones is, is uh, Seamus. He, I mean, he still does some ROM hacks, but. The amount of stuff he's also posted to YouTube is just... If they don't like the stuff you do, I don't think they're going to like the stuff he does. 
many things that's how a lot of it's gonna go. Um, 